And it's 4.30 in Indiana Sheriff announcing cutbacks in coverage. Washington County's top lawman says beginning this week, he'll stop scheduling deputies overnight due to a staffing shortage. In a statement, he called it an unprecedented move, but one he did not make lightly. And he went on to say, quote, we are trying to maintain appropriate police coverage, but simply can't keep working the way we are. He says his department's down six deputies and it's hard to attract and retain officers because nearby agencies are paying more. As a result, he says his remaining officers are working seven to eight hours a day or seven to eight days in a row. I should say 16 shifts, 16 hour shifts at a time on occasion. So beginning Friday night, they will not have deputies on duty from 11 p.m. to 7 a.m. And people who live there, they're understandably concerned. Very disheartening because that's probably when we need them the most is when it's nighttime. Nobody's out and about. Businesses need to be covered. People need to be covered. They won't be completely without coverage. Indiana State Police told me today they plan to have a trooper in that county seven days a week during the overnight hours. But a police shortage is not unique to Washington County uh, down in southern Indiana. Just a few months ago, we told you state police were down about 200 troopers statewide. And look at this Facebook post from Henry County. Reacting to the Washington County Sheriff's decision, Henry County Sheriff John Sproles said he's been waving this warning flag since he took office. He said if decisive corrective action is not taken immediately to pay our officers a minimum of a fair average salary, we will one day be posting the same announcement in Henry County as my friend Sheriff Miller is posting down in Washington County. We'll continue to follow it.